many students appeal to reinstate the subclass 476 visa. Today's video update will discuss the much appealed subclass 476 visa. Recently social media has been teeming with posts asking Alex Hawke to bring back the expired subclass 476 visa. Graduate students who had applied for Australian visa subclass 476 prior to the COVID pandemic and could not come to Australia for the past couple of years have requested the immigration minister to reinstate validity for their expired visas. Australian Green Senator for Tasmania, Nick McKim, has also reached out for an extension of Visa 476 that have expired in the past 21 months due to border closures because of the pandemic. In a letter addressed to Alex Hawke, Minister for Immigration Citizenship Migrant Services and Multicultural Affairs, Mr McKim has requested the Minister to look into the matter urgently. In his letter, the Senator thanked Mr. Hawke for permitting the entry of present and former temporary graduate subclass 485 visa holders from the 18th of February 2022. He also noted another subclass that urgently required to be considered for an extension as well. The Senator wrote that individuals on expired skilled recognized graduate subclass 476 visas expect to have their condition handled by the government. This visa permits recent engineering graduates to work, study, and live in Australia, and the processing duration on this visa can take up to two years. He further stated that hundreds of people have written to him in desperation due to receiving their subclass 476 visa grants just before the 21-month closure of the borders, which has now expired. Last month, the Australian government declared the extension by three years skilled regional provisional subclass 489 491 and 494 visas, where COVID-19 international travel restraints had affected the visa holder. They had also informed that certain qualified temporary graduate subclass 485 visa holders would have their visas extended or enlivened to the 30th of September 2022. However, the dilemma of subclass 476 visa holders has pushed the Green Senator to highlight and challenge the Immigration Minister. He stated that while fresh subclass 476 visa holders can travel to Australia without needing a travel exemption, individuals bearing expired 476 visas are not able to come to Australia and are now required to begin their visa applications from scratch. He has questioned Mr Hawke, asking if he could urgently advise on his plan for the individuals that hold expired 476 visas, mainly whether they will be automatically presented with replacement visas if their visas have expired. Our video update for today ends here. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more updates on Australian immigration. Thanks for watching.